So safe harbor is a law that really is to be um, passed in every state in the union. And that law is saying that any youth, and generally nationwide, it's under 18, any youth that is found sexually exploited or trafficked should be considered a victim and not a criminal. So they should receive services versus being thrown in juvie or thrown in jail for being um, you know, exploited and trafficked. So that's um, the safe harbor law. In Minnesota, we have Minnesota safe harbor law and we have the safe harbor no wrong door model. And so our law was passed in 2011 with a um, task from the legislature and to a huge group body of um, task force to come up with a system of care for these youth. And so we worked for a couple years and developed the safe harbor no wrong door model in Minnesota, which um, got passed and then implemented in 2016. 2014. <laughs> and basically that model gave us a state director, um, um, navigators, point people in every region of the state who are resources for people and educators and to develop system of care in their region. And then um, granted were several organizations. The one that I originally was working at and started the work, which was the Heartland Girls Ranch, I opened the Hearts for Freedom for Teenage Girls. And there were quite, at the time, there was three, four, and it has really, over the years to this year, has expanded. And we have services for boys as well, um, different age groups and different types of shelters and programs and um, advocates in some locations that are leading groups and helping to do street outreach and that kind of thing. So it's a... Basically, it's a system to help get these kids the services they need and the healing they need to get out of this kind of life.